here. What is good, J.I. Squad? And welcome back to it again. Another episode of J.I. Productions. It's your boy, J.I., and I'm back at it again with another banger video for you guys. As you guys can tell by the title and the thumbnail of this video, we are going to be talking about the cam that I got for Vader recently from one of you guys. Yeah, that's right. A J.I. Squad member went ahead and sent out a Stage 3 Texas Speed cam for Vader. And y'all see Vader back there, it's mad dirty. Don't roast me in the comments, but let's go ahead and get a start up with that new cam. Sheesh. Wait. That doesn't sound like a stage three cam. That sounds like a stock LT1 cam. What's, what's going on here? Uh, let's roll that intro and get straight into it. Yeah, what's up with it? Do it cause I love it and I stuck with it We ain't with the sub and in the cut with it Please none of the talks, I heard enough of it Like, what you gon' do? Where you at? Who you with? You ain't really about this, don't talk about it Really on the move, on the map, never slip Keep your hands to your lips, don't talk about it Real eyes, real lies, real lies All the time, stand on it If we said it, we don't walk around it Loose lips, ink ships, red cup, blue strips New phone, who this? No, we don't allow it Really on go, I don't know what's an off day. Now we on road, keep us. All right, y'all. So as you guys can tell by the idol, man, we are still on Vader's stock cam. We have not swapped the stage three Texas speed cam in this car yet. Quick little walk around. I know it is filthy. I haven't watched this car in like three weeks. Surprisingly, the weather out here is actually holding out and it's not raining so i should really be capitalizing on the fact that it's not raining and actually wash this car really detail it because it needs a full interior exterior and engine bay cleanse like this joint needs a smooth detox no cap but let's go ahead and jump straight into the car and get on the road and i can go ahead and talk to you guys and explain to y'all why we're still running the stock cam as y'all can see we do got e85 in the car right now so it's not gonna be as poppy also very unfortunate my insta 360 camera is dead honestly y'all i barely use this camera and i really need to get more content out of this camera for you guys and then for the folks over on tiktok and instagram as well and even for the folks over on youtube shorts man i'm sorry i've been slacking i literally have this camera and it just sits at the crib i don't even use it that's why i didn't even know that it was dead um so i will be making some content with this camera very soon man you guys stay tuned um but like i said we are running some e85 so car is not gonna be backfiring and popping and crackling like we like it as much as it normally does yeah i see barely any pops but yeah man getting straight into this vlog and talking about the simple fact as to why vader is still on the stock cam so i'm just gonna keep it a buck with y'all man i'm not even gonna sugarcoat anything i had a call with my boy manny man over there at straight out performance and you know as you guys know he's gonna be doing the work as far as the cam install goes the pro charger install goes or whipple not 100 percent sure what direction i want to go yet and the heads and everything else um my boy manny's gonna be taking care of this car for sure um so we were on the phone and we were just chopping it up about the cam and getting the install done and whatnot and man my boy manny kind of he kind of opened my eyes a little bit about this cam um that's one thing that i love about my boy manny he's always going to keep it a buck he's never going to sugarcoat anything or lie or or boast about anything to make you know what i'm saying make you feel good he's going to keep it a buck let you know the ins and the outs of whatever it is that you're planning to do to your car um and get you all the information that you need so that you can be able to make an informed decision he literally works just like i do no sugar coating no cutting corners no nothing like it's just legit work like you know what i'm saying it's just legit reasonably charged reasonably priced whatever you guys want to call it work like it's not 
He's not taxing. He's not BSing. None of that. Like, dude is, dude is doing his thing for sure out there in the community. So if you guys are in the Houston area, in the Texas area, in the Pasadena area, man, make sure you tap in with my boy, man. He no cap. But yeah, man, y'all let me know what y'all think about this angle right here. I literally have my phone above my head as if I was playing charades. But I feel like it's going to give you guys the most optimal point of view like you know what i'm saying you should be able to see the street you should be able to see the steering wheel and the speedo y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section down below if y'all like it i will get a gopro with a head mount and we'll keep this point of view thing going keep it in the vlogs but like i said i had a conversation with my boy manny and basically we were just talking about the cam and the pros and the cons of running the cam ultimately this is texas speed's biggest state like biggest cam as far as NA goes, it is the stage three cam. They actually discontinued this cam because they were able to make more power out of a smaller cam, which actually is the LC7 cam, which fun fact, my boy who sent out this cam actually went down to that cam. Um, so yeah, talk to Texas Speed about it, you know, and they kind of informed Manny that, you know, yeah, this car, this cam is gonna make power, like for sure. But the only thing is, yes, it's gonna make power, but the power is gonna be made at the very, very top end. So that being said, if I go and throw the Pro Charger on this car, like I want to, I'm just gonna have nothing but top end power and I'm gonna lose all my low end torque and power. So like the car is not gonna feel as punchy on the streets versus as it will on the freeway man so that being said i'm not 100 percent sure which way i want to go do i run a run in this cam and just have nothing but straight top end power or do i want to go ahead and get the btr stage 2 cam like i was going to do and just throw the pro charger on there so i can get some more top end power i'm not 100 percent sure to be honest with you guys also in running the stage three cam i would need to replace the stock stall converter and go ahead and put in like a 3500 stall or 40 a four grand stall from circle d and with that being said i'd have to get a custom made stall from circle d because they don't offer a stall that's big enough for this cam so these are all things that my boy manny kind of just brought to my attention when going into camming this car and running that cam and so basically y'all i just got a lot of stuff to think about right now i'm not 100 percent sure um which direction i'm gonna go if i do go ahead and run this cam i'm really leaning more towards just throwing the a stock i mean not a stock but throwing a stall converter in the car as you're supposed to when you run this big of a cam yes you know you can run this big of a cam and not have an issue multiple people have done it but at the end of the day you guys know vader is my daily driver this is the only car that we have on the channel so with that being said i need this car to be running in order to make content for you guys in order to make vlogs that you know what i'm saying you guys want to see i'm gonna need this car to be running so that being said y'all y'all let me know in the comment section down below what do you guys think i should do do I go ahead and throw the cam in the car without the stall and leave the stock stall converter and see if, you know, I'll be able to drive it and, you know, not have any issues for a long time and just, you know, really play with my luck? Or do I play it safe, get the BTR Stage 2 cam or get a stall converter for the car um, and run that Stage 3 cam? Y'all let me know in the comment section down below. Also, tap in, let your boy know what y'all think about this angle, man. Was this lit? Do y'all like that I have it this high? Do y'all want me to bring it down here where y'all can barely see? Like, y'all let me know in the comments, man, what y'all think. I really read every comment and try to get back to you guys as soon as possible. If you guys have been commenting, you guys already know. Or if you've been a part of the J.I. Squad for a minute, then you guys already know because you will see my reply underneath almost every single comment. You dig what I'm saying? But yeah, man, with that being said, y'all, that's going to wrap it up for today's video. I do apologize for my Insta360 being dead. I really wanted to get those clips in for you guys. Um, y'all, just enjoy some of the clips from when I was getting some data logs in for NRG concerning the tune. I can actually insert some of those clips here now. So y'all enjoy those.
if you guys are new to the channel, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this video up here. Hit that subscribe button. Join the JI squad. Drop a comment in the comment section down below. Let me know what you guys think about this angle. Do y'all like it up here? Do y'all like it down there? Like, you know what I'm saying? Y'all let me know. Do y'all like the POVs? Do y'all not like the POVs? Tap in with me because if y'all do, then I'll go ahead and make the investment in the channel and buy yet again another camera. So we'll have three, technically four cameras for the vlogs, man. So y'all let me know in the comment section down below what y'all think about this angle. Also, do we go ahead? Hold on. Y'all already know what we got to do. Y'all already know what we got to do. That's dirty, y'all. That's all some reds, at least. Oh, somebody got scared. <laughs> somebody got scared. Anyway, at least I could get y'all some reds. But yeah, like I said, man, do we get a custom stall made for the Stage 3 cam? Or do we get the BTR Stage 2 cam, run the stock stall, throw a pro charger on this joint, and send her? I don't know. Y'all let me know in the comment section down below. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Even if you're not new, you may not be subscribed. YouTube could have unsubscribed you, man. So just make sure that it says subscribed in past tense, not subscribe as in you still need to do it. Alrighty, y'all. I'm going to go ahead and wrap this joint up here. Let's roll that intro, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. So this is new. The cluster is not lit, and my heads up display is not working either. I don't know what's going on, but yeah, I'm gonna try to turn it off, turn it back on. What the heck? Bro, this is so weird, like, I don't even understand what's going on right now. <laughs> like the cluster is just like nothing. All black, all bad right now, all bad.